Hey what's up guys Dhruval here with another video and in this video I'm gonna show you how to create this beautiful soft light color effect in Photoshop. So let's get started. So to create this effect I'm using this image from Deventa.com and if you want to use the same image the download link is in the description. So you can go to file and open any image you want. So once it's open inside Photoshop, I'm going to start with the adjustment layers. So click here on this little icon and select color balance right here. And after that, go to your shadows and make sure you have selected preserve luminosity. So uh, after that, go to your uh, shadows and add plus 31 blues. So we have that dark blue in the shadows. So 30 is fine. And after that, go to your highlights and add yellows so i'm gonna add maybe like 35 looks nice so after that as you can see here we have good amount of contrast and good split toning but some portion of the images are too damn dark so for that all you have to do is select your brush make sure opacity is between like 30 30 40 so i'm gonna keep it 34 and then uh, select your mask and paint with black color in this area so you can hide those really dark patches so paint take your time and paint carefully remove this from this really dark areas so that looks really nice we created a really nice split toning and after that create another adjustment layers and select curves yes it was curves i remember so in curves uh, let's go and see what the values we have so first of all here's the adjustment layer of color balance and here's the curves so in the curves we have a bit of a contrast boosting so I'm gonna boost a bit of highlights here and bit of shadows here then let's go to red and I'm gonna add some little of the maybe a bit of cyan and then let's go to greens and I'm gonna add slight green not too much make sure that you don't overdo it so slight green and slight so let's go to blues and I've done the same thing a slight blue tone and then a bit of a yellow in the shadows so that looks nice so now the light lick itself so there are millions way to create light licks and I am still finding more and more new amazing ways but till now this one is the best you have to create a new blank layer so you can create it from here and then I'm gonna go back and select that color again so let's select this reddish color and then uh, as we made our opacity 100% make your brush like super large right click and make sure hardness is 0% and then paint in this some of the areas so that looks nice so right now it looks terrible but just change the blend mode to screen and you suddenly have an awesome light leak now temporary it can look terrible so what to do is uh, you press ctrl T to bring up your transformation tools and then you squeeze it a bit so we can make it look like it's coming from the top so that looks good so you can always like change the color too so once you think that the proportion of the light leak looks good or you want to make it even bigger so you can do something like this keep playing with it until you are satisfied so that looks okay and then what you can do is you go to image adjustment and you select hue saturation and here you can do any type of color you want like if you want to go crazy and you want to make like purple or cyan or anything you can do it so I'm just gonna make it a bit of a red and gonna make it a bit more saturated since I like that color better so that looks fine you can also like duplicate this layer and like put it here and then rotate it just press ctrl T and rotate it from here that can also look great so after that uh, let's see what we have yes so this is a cool trick like as you can see this is way too bright and if I make the opacity like 100% you cannot see the things on the behind like on top it's way too bright so what to do is you create a new blank layer on the top from here and then you press ctrl alt shift and E so it will create a JPG inside Photoshop and then you just change the blend mode to multiply so it will make whole thing darker but we do not want whole thing just the top part so you apply a layer mask from here you select your brush like this and then you make sure the color is black 
and then you remove it from this unnecessary area something like that and you can also like bring back if, if you paint with the white color it's gonna bring back the layer and if you paint with the black color it's gonna hide it so that looks okay and now I'm gonna make my opacity zero and then I will come back so I can see how much dark I need so that like 50% 55% looks okay so we have that contrast back after that create another adjustment layers and select curves so in the curves let's go to red I'm gonna add a bit of a red okay that looks good matches with the top looks nice and then let's go to blues and go crazy and add a lot of blue and then a lot of yellow so that already looks awesome like you can see that yellow skin yellow color in her skin that matches really nice with this blue background like blue in the stones so that looks dope so this way you can create and if you want like even more powerful you can just press ctrl j and duplicate this layer to make this effect even more powerful but I don't think that looks really nice but it's a matter of personal taste so this way you can create really awesome soft light effects in Photoshop and if you have any questions feel free to ask me in the comments and if you like the video give it a thumbs up that would be really helpful and also check out this awesome tutorials by tutorials junction so till then goodbye take care and have some fun with Photoshop